Obfuscation is a technique used in software development to make the source code or compiled code more difficult to understand or reverse engineer. The primary goal of obfuscation is to add a layer of protection to the code by making it challenging for someone to analyze or decompile the original software. This is particularly important in scenarios where developers want to protect intellectual property, sensitive algorithms, or prevent unauthorized access to their code. Here are some common techniques employed in code obfuscation. Renaming. Changing the names of variables, methods, and classes to more cryptic or meaningless identifiers. This makes it harder for someone to understand the purpose of different elements in the code. Control flow obfuscation. Altering the structure of the code's control flow, such as adding unnecessary branches, loops, or conditional statements. This makes the code flow less predictable and complicates the understanding of the program's logic. String encryption. Encrypting string literals in the code and dynamically decrypting them at runtime. This makes it difficult for an attacker to identify and understand the actual strings used in the program, such as API keys or sensitive information. Code packing. Compressing or encrypting the entire executable and adding a decompression or decryption routine at runtime. This can make it more challenging for someone to analyze the code statically, as the actual code is only revealed during execution. Dead code injection. Injecting sections of code that are never executed, dead code, to confuse reverse engineers. These sections serve no functional purpose but can mislead those attempting to understand the code. Anti-debugging techniques. Incorporating mechanisms that detect and thwart debugging attempts, making it more difficult for reverse engineers to step through the code using debugging tools. .NET Obfuscation Tools. .NET Obfuscation is a technique used to protect .NET applications by making the code more difficult to understand and reverse engineer. Obfuscation tools transform the source code into a more complex and less readable form, making it challenging for someone to decompile and analyze the original code. Here are some popular .NET Obfuscator tools. Dotfuscator. Dotfuscator is a widely used obfuscation tool for .NET applications. It offers various features such as renaming, string encryption, control flow obfuscation, and more. Dotfuscator is often integrated into Microsoft Visual Studio for easy use. SmartAssembly SmartAssembly is a .NET obfuscator and optimization tool. It provides features like method encryption, control flow obfuscation, and string encryption. It also includes runtime error reporting and exception analytics. Crypto Obfuscator for .NET Crypto Obfuscator offers code obfuscation, string encryption, and other security features. It supports various .NET platforms and can integrate with Visual Studio. In addition to obfuscation, it provides other code protection mechanisms. YazyFuscatter.net YazyFuscatter.net is a free and easy-to-use obfuscator for .NET applications. It provides basic obfuscation features like renaming and control flow obfuscation. While the free version is feature limited, there is a paid version with advanced features. Babel Obfuscator Babel Obfuscator is a .NET obfuscator that supports various obfuscation techniques. It offers features such as renaming, string encryption, and control flow obfuscation. It aims to provide protection against both static and dynamic analysis. ConfuseX's Open Source Tool ConfuseX is an open source obfuscator for .NET applications. It supports a range of obfuscation techniques and is actively maintained by the community. It's suitable for developers looking for a free and customizable obfuscation solution. Remember that while obfuscation adds a layer of protection, it is not foolproof. Determined attackers may still find ways to reverse engineer obfuscated code. It's often recommended to use a combination of obfuscation, encryption, and other security measures for more robust protection. Additionally, legal measures and licensing mechanisms can also be employed to deter unauthorized use and distribution of your software.